Hello and welcome to the Soft Hummingbird Tutorials. This is a series of tutorials in which I will show you the program Gvideon. In this video I'll show you how to make a line profile through your data, how to extract it, how to save it, and how to use it in another program such as Excel, and how to fit functions to these line profiles such as a Lorentzian or a Gaussian. Ok, the profile lines. For that you just click here. If you want to analyze your data, you are interested in the exact profile of the surface. Define the line position, length and the thickness of the line. This feature is very nice, since you can average over many parallel lines like this. Or you could just select one line. Here you see the thickness of the line. After you click execute, you get a little window with your extracted profile. Now you can empty the line and close this window. You can plot the profile logarithmically in X and Y axis. A nice feature is the right click on the profile. Here you can select and do different things. Export the image as a bitmap in the PNG format, which then looks like this. Ok, next step we export the real data points. Right click on the extracted profile and select Save as Text. Now you can specify some export formats. If you select plain text or origin friendly, your exported file will look like this with your X and Y values. This format is quite strange however since you have all the strange spaces here in, and in between the values. If you select GNU plot friendly, you'll get a file that looks like this. Now, all the strange spaces at the end of the lines are gone, but not in between the values. Exporting as comma separated values. Exporting as comma separated values is my favorite since the values are separated by semicolons as in this file here. Now if you want to use Excel you just have to replace the semicolons with a tab. You can do this with find and replace or by using one of my programs ready replace. With ready replace you can find and replace text in files or in file names. Also, you can save tasks if you want to use them frequently. For our case, you drag and drop the file into the file list. Double click here to define a find and replace operation. You look for a semicolon and replace it with a tab. Here already you see how many replacements are pending. Say execute and take a look at the file again. All the semicolons are replaced with a tab and you can easily insert the data into Excel. Copy the text and paste it into Excel. Since the values are separated by tabs now, the values are going to two columns. Insert a diagram, a point diagram, with connected lines. And that's it. To make it a little nicer, format the y-axis. Double click on the Y axis, select manual axis value and insert the minimum Y value. That's it. Next thing we will fit functions to the extracted profile. For that click on fit function. In the new window you can select the function to be fitted. For example a Gaussian. Select the area where you want to fit the function and click on fit.
or for example a Lorentzian. Apply this to have the fitted function in your profile. Ok, that was the first advanced tutorial in which you learned how to extract a line profile and how to save and export this line data and how to use it in different, fun in different programs and how to fit functions to these lines. The next tutorial is very simple. It shows how to generate a cool 3D image from your data. Don't forget to vote if you like this video and subscribe. Also, please visit my webpage Soft Hummingbird where you can download many tutorials and sample data files.